Don't you understand? Because some people are questioning, you know, who the hell I am. I'm a person who was born into this planet. And this planet's systems don't serve me at all. The systems that are currently in place are actively working to kill me. Anybody watching my video can see I'm attacked electronically all day long for years. But before this, this capitalist nightmare never worked for me. Never. I worked and 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 worked. What did I get out of it? I can't work it because of the electronic harassment. But even without that, the capitalist nightmare has made it impossible. Impossible for me. And I've tried so many times to adapt to make myself available for people that want to employ me. And all I get over and over again is, you know, not enough money. Always not enough money, not enough money. Not enough money. Not enough money, not enough money. Not enough money, not enough money. Not enough money, not enough money. And so on and so on. So I can't make it under the system that I was born into. So that's why I'm against it. And I'm for change. Complete change. 100% change. And that's why I'm attacked as a light worker. Because I think that we can do better. And I see nothing but civilization going down the toilet under the current people. It's never been worse than it is now. So if anybody asks, you know, why am I so vocal? It's because. That's why. And anybody who wants to, do, well, I don't know what else other argument there is. It doesn't serve me, period. As far as anybody else goes, it doesn't serve civilization. So, what do I do about it? I, I talk, don't I? I talk, I talk, I talk, I talk. I talk about it. But I'm here. Why didn't the system adapt to people? Why? Why doesn't it look at people and say, clearly you need more money to live in an inflated economy? The system never looks out. Never looks out to see. And in the end, the system failed me. So, that's the way it is. It's got to go. And everybody who's associated with the system and won't let go of it, they got to go too. That's just the way it is. Evolve or die. And people that are holding on to the current system of capitalism and everything that goes with it, you're going to die. You're going to die anyway. But you're going to die because you won't let go of this mess that kills me. So it's, you know, kill or be killed. And I'm not doing anything. I'm not doing anything. The way the system comes down is bad karma. Bad, horrific karma is what this is all about. The karma brings down everything to do with whatever these systems are that I was born into on planet Earth. I don't have to do anything. It's horrible karma that brings it all down. And if you are allied with all this, then you're allied with that karma. And that karma is what is going to go and kill you, according to the opinion that I'm going to give you from me. It's just my opinion. Is it aggressively in your face or something? It's just my opinion. Take it or leave it. I'm constantly blocked from expressing my own opinion. Constantly by this electronic harassment. So there is no free speech, America. Because I'm your neighbor in Canada. And my free speech is totally being blocked. My ability to breathe is constantly under attack. My physical being is always being trying to wipe me out 
That's how evil these fucking people are. So, you know, this is all day long for years and years and years and years. These people, they won't surrender, so they gotta die. And if you're serving the 1% and their capitalist nightmare, then you're gonna go with it. It's your choice. It's an antichrist system, it's from hell. Before 1987, planet Earth was technically a hell world. And you can look that up. 1987 Harmonic Concordance. And then we had the 1969 song, the, the dawning of the age of Aquarius. It means the end of the age of Pisces, which is the end of control and evil. That was 50 years ago. So we're well into Aquarius. So don't hold on to Pisces. I'm serious. Because you're ignoring the signs that the universe has given you. And that's stupid. And if you're going to be stupid, then there's nothing I can do to cure stupid. What do you need to do? Stop eating meat. I'll give you one thing. Stop eating meat. Can you do that?